this restaurant will be either beautiful or it will be a rubbish. Police line do not cross. <laughs> it's not everyday chicken and chips. Yeah, boss, can I have that free wings and chips, please? Yeah, that burger sauce as well, bro. Hello, my name is Luimo. Thank you for clicking on this video. Today we are going to review one of my highest reviewed Yay! Southern Star American restaurants on my Google Food account, which has over 150,000 reviews. I'm so happy. Oh, that is wonderful. This restaurant is called The Fat Bear. It's not everyday chicken and chips. This one is upgrade, man. Yeah, boss, can I have that free wings and chips, please? Yeah, that burger sauce as well, bro. The Fat Bear restaurant has an overall rating of 4.5 out of 5 on Google. Don't worry, I will give you all the information that you need in this video. Let's eat. yeah listen are you listening this restaurant opens six days a week monday to saturday the kitchen opens between 12 and 2 30 and that is for lunch and brunch and then it reopens at six o'clock up until 9 30 and that's just for the dinner now they have a set menu for bookings so you need to make sure that you email them and ask them what the bookings entails and they are very very helpful thank you Garrett. they also offer a christmas menu and i only found that out today they have free wi-fi and they are also on delivery so hey my dear if you are living somewhere around that restaurant you are very lucky unfortunately they don't have a youtube page but i managed to find two videos hmm. about the fat bear on a YouTube page called Fine Dining TV. So make sure you have a look at that. You can find more information Yay! on the Fat Bear by visiting their website. You can also go to their Facebook page, their Instagram page, and their Twitter page. Now onto their USP, I think for the Fat Bear, their event is the main thing. They have an annual seafood boil called the Crawfish Seafood Boil. Hey, when you see the website of the seafood boil, my dear, you will faint. It just looks so mouthwatering. The crawfish seafood boil happens in the summer and it's between June and September. Now for this, you need to go onto their website because they always give you the link to purchase the ticket. Yes, you have to buy a ticket. Oh really? But it is worth it because you just pay one price and it is an Yay! all you can eat. My dear, it is all you can eat now buffet. Now, unfortunately <laughs> this year, I was not able to purchase a ticket. And the reason why I didn't is because I went to Miami and experienced my first seafood boil there. And there will be a video up for that. So make sure that you stay tuned onto my YouTube channel. Are you thirsty? Well, if the answer is yes, I will show you the selection of drinks. They have a selection of sweet and dry white wine. They also have a selection of rosé, red wine, beer. They have cognac, they have whiskey, they have brandy, they have tequila, they have gin, vodka, liquors. They also serve sparkling champagne. So if you are celebrating an event, cheers. What I love about the cocktail menu is that on each cocktail that is displayed on the menu, it has a small description of what the cocktail tastes like. So it will tell you if it's light, if it's refreshing, if it's fruity, if it's boozy. Now, because I was the designated driver, I had to order something a bit softer. I had to order a mocktail. The mocktail that I ordered was called Fo. F-A-U-X. It has passion fruit. It has OJ. Me, I don't know if OJ means orange juice, but know. it has OJ. And it also had phalanum. Phalanum is a syrup liquor from the Caribbean and is best used for tropical drinks. It has flavors of ginger, lime, almond, and allspice. So enjoy. 
I ordered for starters two things that were on the menu that screamed out ASMR. Deep fried pickled peppers and corn dog. The crispiness of the fried pickles, the tanginess of the sauce, the spicy sausage that was sunk into that butter. You will not regret it. It was so tasty. For the corn dogs you get two. For the deep fried pickled peppers I believe you get five or six. I wasn't counting because I was too busy eating. On the Fat Bear starters menu they have deviled eggs, deep fried pickled peppers, buffalo wings, pimento cheese, corn dogs, southern fried buttermilk chicken tenders, gumbo, spinach dip and buttermilk biscuit chicken sandwich. You can find more information on the starters menu on the Fat Bear website. Now let's get moving on to the mains. Now for the main, the Fat Bear offers a very tasty selection of dishes. They have two signature burgers, the Fat Bear burger and the Southern Fried Buttermilk Chicken Sandwich. I ordered the Fat Bear burger. It was out of this world. I seriously could not eat any more. The Fat Bear burger comes with a double house made beef patty, which is juicy and very meaty and very well seasoned. It also comes with American cheese, caramelized onions, a fat mm. bear secret sauce, demi brioche potato bun with a bed Yay. of fries. If you want to sprinkle a surprise to your burger, you can add cheddar, American or blue cheese, bacon, avocado or pimento cheese, onions or jalapeno peppers. The choice is yours. You can also try the chicken fried steak, the southern fried chicken and waffles, seafood siapino, chicken and shrimp gumbo, a vegan gumbo, and a salad. If you are vegan, turning vegan, transporting as vegan, or have vegan as DNA, you can have the vegan gumbo. Mm. Or if you are trying to lose weight, you can have salad. The Fat Bear also offers a family styled fried chicken dinner, and that consists of southern buttermilk fried chicken, sriracha maple syrup, and four choices of your size. Now that is 20 pounds per person for a minimum of three people. The second time I went to the Fat Bear, I ordered waffles and chicken. The waffles were very fluffy, soft inside, but crispy on the outside. The chicken was very buttery, seasoned very well well. The crispiness of the chicken was just beautiful. And to top it all off, they have sriracha maple syrup. When I saw that, I said, eh? I am gone. I was in heaven. You can also try sriracha mayo, blue cheese sauce, hot pepper jelly, Creole remoulade, buffalo sauce and ranch. The cornbread was really light and fluffy and on top it was drizzling with maple syrup. You would just see bubbles of caramel. Mm. The garlic fries was just beautiful. The potato was fresh. The garlic was fresh. The oil was fresh. The spring onion was fresh. Everything was just fresh. I was like, ah, ah. This is too much for one person. The portion was really good. That's what I was really impressed Yay. with. I couldn't even finish it myself. So I had to do takeaway. Why have I not ordered mac and cheese? I don't know. So you know what I did? Yes, you name it. I ordered mac and cheese. It was so delicious. It was rich. And they put cheese mm. crumb on top. In my opinion, I would have to say it's the best mac and cheese that I've tasted. Now onto desserts, everyone loves a bit of dessert. I am obsessed with citrus desserts. I love lemon cheesecake, I love lemon tarts, I love lime cheesecake. And as soon as I saw on the dessert menu, uh. key lime pie, I was sold. They have Oreo cheesecake, they have waffles and cream, they have a selection of ice cream. Now this flaming Alaska, me, I didn't see this one no. This is a new one, man. It has sponge, fruit, mm. ice cream, Italian meringue, Rum and flum, wait, rum flumbe, rum, rum what? I ordered a key lime pie. The shortbread biscuit at the bottom was very buttery and crispy on the outside. The filling of the key lime pie was just a really good balance. It had a balance of sweetness, it had a balance of citrus. It was just mwah. And to top it all off, I believe they had a candied lime Yay! on top. So mouth watering. A next step to heaven. I didn't know this, but I was reading on the menu and I saw that you can purchase Cuban cigars. When I saw this, I thought, uh -huh, 
this is good for people who want to look like a boss. If you want to look like Rick Ross, if you want to look like DJ Khaled, or even Tony Montana from Scarface, smoke Cuban cigar and tell them what is good. So with the food and drink, you don't even no. need me to repeat it. I love their food i love their drinks i experienced so many flavors i can't i can't let me give it a score i give it a 4.5 out of 5. now onto the vibe the fat bear restaurant plays lovely jazz music and they also play music from iconic movies music from jackie brown they played music from pulp fiction you feel mm. relaxed before you get your delicious food. I want my food though. Well done, the fat bear. For the vibe, I'm gonna give 4.5. The next category is family friendly. This one's quite mm. a difficult one for me because they don't have a kid's menu, but they do provide dishes that kids can eat. Because of the location of the restaurant, some parents may think that it is not an appropriate location for a child to be brought to a restaurant on top of a pub. But you can work around Yay! that. If you wanna bring your family, including kids, to the Fat Bear restaurant, I advise you to bring them during the lunch period, between 12 and 2.30. Anything after that, my dear, it is at your own risk. But for know. adults in your family, this is a perfect place. So for family friendly, I will give a 3.5. Moving on to their customer service. The service was very quick. We received our drinks five minutes after we sat down and received our starters, I believe 10 minutes after, which is perfect. The waitress was very, very helpful. And one thing I like about this restaurant yeah. is when I was asking for a takeaway, they didn't ask me to do it. Am I on your payroll? They did it for me and they brought it with some good bugs. That is what you call good customer service. My scoring for the Fat Bear for customer service, I would have to give a 4.5. On the money category of Luomo star rating. Now this is based on how much you can spend. And I think it's quite average, you know, you pay for what you get and the portions are really good. I spent roughly around 34 pounds on my main starters and dessert. The amount that you can spend on average will be between 35 and 50 pounds. I enjoyed the food, I enjoyed the customer service, I enjoyed the vibe, I enjoyed the music, I enjoyed the drink. Take my money! The money category of Luomo star rating. I would give this restaurant a four out of five. My final thoughts on this restaurant is I am Yay! so happy that I found you. Unfortunately, I didn't experience the seafood boil. However, I will be purchasing my ticket next year. Now the Fat Bear sent me images mm. of their Christmas food. Oh yeah, check the pictures. And another one. <laughs> mouth watering so why not stop by for your christmas party tell me what you think about this restaurant if you have been there if you have not been there what is taking you so long are you waiting for pet day i have left links down in the description box information about the restaurant information on how to get there pdfs on the menu thank you very much for watching this video i hope you were entertained and i hope this video has encouraged you to abracadabra to the fat bear restaurant subscribe to my Yay! channel if if you want more videos like this click on the like button share this video around until next time ciao ciao